could be added to a premium, premium only 2012 TV. Um, and uh, it basically uh, takes the dual core processor that's in last year's TV, makes it a 1.3 gigahertz quad core processor. It improves the GPU, gives it more system memory, so that uh, it makes you know last year's TV perform like a 2013. Plus, you gain all of the new uh, smart interface um, and all the increased functionality. It'll even make the picture look better. So, if you had to guess, with Evolution Kit, how long would you expect this to actually be supported? So, if I bought, because it's, it's a reason to go out and buy a new Samsung TV sure. right now, yeah. you know. So, in the future. I don't have to buy a new TVs because I can upgrade it. But then right. eventually, you guys want to want to sell more TVs. You, you're right about that. And so the average consumer buys a TV about every actually now because of computers, it's about seven years. It used to be ten, but it's now about seven years. Uh, we will support the 2012 TV until 2016. So you can you will see a four year supporting. You know, we'll drag your TV along for four years. That's pretty good. When, I, what, I mean, like you said, consumers upgrade once every like seven years. Right, exactly. So I mean, what is the how can you say, oh, you're going to get more system memory, maybe you're going to get a faster processor? Unless you're like a tech geek, that's kind of a hard sell, right? What's the cost of this thing? Uh, cost has not been announced yet, but it's going to be, we think it's going to be south of $500. Um, that's but not yes, bad at all. Uh, yeah, you'll see it uh, actually ship in March, and we'll, we'll announce uh, pricing at that point. Um, but, um, you know, it, it'll, it's very actually very simple to install as well. So it just simply plugs in the back of the TV. It's a simple upgrade that somebody could do. And, um, you know, it's one of those things that if you don't see the value in it this year, fine. You don't have to buy it this year. Your you might see the value next, next year. year. But you may see the value next year as things improve in the 2014 model. So, you know, things will always move forward. Very cool. So can we, like, can I, like, wave at this and it'll show me something uh, cool? Actually, well, we have a, a live demonstration right over here, and he'll be able to show you with the brand new remote control as well. So the whole idea in the Smart Hub is you have five panels. Um, and the first one is called On TV, which I'll get James to go to right now. So this is the first one that pops up when you turn your TV on. Um, and it shows you various different uh, uh, things here. So um, it's going to suggest things that you would normally watch, it, like say in the morning. Um, so if you normally watch the view, it tells you how far into your program uh, the view is right now so that you can make that choice if you want to actually jump in 25 or 30 minutes into the program or whatever the next thing is if you want to watch the people's court you know that it comes out in 34 minutes so you can help make that choice you can S recommendation is brand new right S recommendation is also brand new which is basically our way of helping you decide what to watch in TV it's a whole idea so can you wave at this TV and make it do something uh, it is not set up for that here it they, they can show you the gesture controls over in the gesture control area. In the gesture control. Okay, so for right now, can you just show me, like, the coolest stuff that you can do with this remote? And can I actually show my, my camera the remote real quick? Because it's pretty sleek. Yeah. So is this, like, a little touch? That is a touch area, yeah. Awesome. So right now we have, like, recommended movies and TV shows. You can this see what's on right now. Streaming content. Yeah. Uh, and then this was, this was the panel he was showing you earlier. Yeah. This is your applications. So it's all very easily organized. Uh, and then here you have uh, basically recommendations that your friends make for like YouTube videos so that'll show up here. Um, and then if you want to do Skype, it's all your last eight Skype conversations all right there. That's really cool. And then what's the one to the far right, the photo one? Is that just a slideshow of your photo? No, this is content, music, movies, and video that you have already uh, either on your phone, on your on your computer, that sort of thing. Very cool, very, very cool. So what else do you have to show me, man?